Our goal is to train fellows to be the best they can be. And so at the beginning of the fellowship and throughout the fellowship, um, I meet with each of them. We talk about what their goals are and we try to set milestones to be able to reach those goals. One of the biggest advantages with Beaumont is the fact that you have a multi-speciality team. You get to work with experts in all fields of cardiology. There's advanced imaging available to us to accompany our EP procedures, which goes a long ways when you're doing a complicated case. We have a robust watchman program, and the advanced fellows, the EP and the structural interventional fellows, work in conjunction um, to get trained in that field. I was looking for an ideal mix of academic and private practice. I like the fact that there's so many different attendings and you get to learn a little something from everyone. You learn different styles of doing the same thing and I think you can bring all of those together and make your own style of doing things when you go out into practice. There's a very high caseload. Not only do you get trained in your bread and butter, which is the devices, um, and SVTs, but you also get to do advanced ablations, which include atrial fibrillation, VT, PVC ablations. You're not waiting six months or a year to go to be able to scrub into those procedures. Right from day one, you're allowed to participate in those. And then depending on your level of training, the attendings allow autonomy. And it's great to be able to do a procedure all on your own before you graduate and are thrown into the real world where you're on your own in the true sense. Research is important in the program in a couple of ways. One is we want fellows to learn how to read research. And so we have Journal Club as part of our curriculum so the fellows can really understand how studies are put together. And then we want fellows to help design and implement a research study so they can become able to do that on their own. That helps whether or not they're going into academics or private practice to be able to really understand research and understand how to read research. Our attendings are very interested in research and they guide you throughout. They're always available to review manuscripts. The turnaround time is very quick. Um, and often they'll give you personal feedback as to how to improve the paper and your own writing skills. So overall, if you're interested in research, they'll definitely support you. We have a great state-of-the-art hospital that's an academic tertiary center, as well as a large community hospital that we work out of. And so we have all the mapping systems that are available. We get to treat uncommon or even rare cases because we're a tertiary referral center that get uh, patients from a lot of other hospitals, but also we keep the the fellowship training program small enough that fellows get to have hands-on experience. So they don't just watch somebody else do the case, but they get to be more of a participant in a case that somewhere else they might either not see or not get the opportunity to, to be intimately involved in. Even as a first year fellow, I was able to scrub into this rare case of a Brigada syndrome, uh, where we went ahead and did epicardial ablation. And it's such a rare, rare thing that there's very few cases that are done throughout the country. And me, as a first year fellow, got to be a part of it, was very, very exciting for me. It's absolutely our goal to make sure the fellows learn as much as they can here and get as much experience as possible, while still maintaining a balance in their work and their, and their outside life. We really think this is part of them developing this sort of ability that they're gonna carry on through the rest of their career. Medicine's hard, and you need to learn a way to balance medicine and, and the rest of your life. There's a very, very congenial atmosphere at work. They treat you as a colleague. There's mutual respect for each other. It's actually an enjoyable atmosphere. I look forward to coming to work every day. One of the fun things about electrophysiology is that it's changed throughout my career. Um, things that I do now are very different than when I was a fellow, and I expect that'll be true for the fellows as they go through the fellowship program. Nevertheless, our goal is to give them a broad experience, understanding that throughout the course of your career, it's going to change, but at least you kind of understand and been exposed to everything that, that's available right now in the field of electrophysiology. Thank you for your interest in the Beaumont Cardiac Electrophysiology Fellowship Program. I hope you like what you see.